Your parents are getting old. I don't know why I'm getting so emotional while seeing this. Producer Ekta Kapoor, who is set to bring her upcoming film Goodbye to the audience, had an emotional moment at the film's trailer launch with Saw Rashmika Mandana, Pavel Gulati, Nina Gupta and Amitabh Bachchan in attendance at a multiplex in Mumbai. Goodbye tells the story of a family that comes together after the character of an old woman played by Nina Gupta passes away. The trailer of the film made everyone at the event tear up a little including Ekta. As she prepared to share a few words about the film and her insights with regards to the story and characters at the trailer, Ekta welled up as she suddenly realized that her parents are getting older day by day. Ekta could barely speak a few words as she became overwhelmed with the emotions. I think we all have a lot of parents with our parents. And uh, we all have a lot of things to say to our parents. Gussa kiya hai, but there's always that time when you get scared. Your parents are getting old. I don't know why I'm getting so emotional while seeing this. I actually welled up when I saw the promo. I think it's, uh, it's an age. You start worrying for your parents. And I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm hating it. So I'll pass. Ekta is the daughter of senior actor Jitendra and producer Shobha Kapoor. Goodbye marks Rashmika Mandana's debut in Hindi films. Prior to this, the actress swooned the nation over with her role of Sri Valli in Alu Arjun's starred mega blockbuster Pushpa The Rise. Goodbye, directed by Vikas Behel, is set to release in theatres on October 7. home I'm sorry and Bachchan sir I remember he's like no 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 she's coming to my house and we sort of like had a uh, you know this actual uh, father daughter wala argument actress Rashmika Mandana who is set to make her big Bollywood debut with the upcoming film goodbye was totally in awe of the puppy that features in the film in fact she had a friendly fight with her co-actor in the film, the veteran superstar Amitabh Bachchan, over who would take the puppy home after the film's wrap-up. Interestingly, the pup has a rather surprising name, Stupid, which is quite unusual for dogs who are known for their wit and intelligence. Speaking to the media at the trailer launch event of the film, Rashmika said, uh, I have literally kidnapped her. Because uh, stupid, it wasn't, uh, you see stupid right here, na? So um, when they got it on set, I remember that I was so in awe of her. So I was like, I'm, I'm going to take her home, I'm sorry. And Bachchan sir, I remember, he's like, no, 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 she's coming to my house. And we sort of like had a, uh, you know, this actual uh, father-daughter wala argument. I think I had it with Mr. Bachchan there <laughs> at that point of time where I was like, no, sir, I'm taking her home. And both of us did this the whole day. We were like, no, we were, uh, I'm going to take her home. I'm going to take her home. So in the end, she's in my house. She's in the cool. sir, I've talked about sir here. So I'll tell you, sir has joined us. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Mr. Hi, Amitabh Bachchan. Seems like the actress has no qualms about kidnapping the papa. After all, everything is fair in love and talks are known to invoke the feelings of love and compassion to the highest degree. Goodbye, directed by Vikas Pehel will debut in theatres on October 7. Bollywood couple Ranbir Kapoor and Alia Bhatt were stopped from offering prayers at the Sri Mahakalishwar Temple in Ujjain due to a protest by Bajrang the activist. According to the police, the couple was supposed to offer prayers on Tuesday for which the temple committee along with the district administration and the police had made elaborate security arrangements. However, the Bajrang Dal activist opposed the actor's entry based on an alleged remark made by Ranbir Kapoor in 2011 over the beef issue. A video of the incident, right-wing activist protesting surfaced on social media on Wednesday. 
hell up. Madam, 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 madam. As per informed sources, Ranbir and Alia stayed at Ujjain District Collector Ashish Singh's official residence before returning to Indore. Directed by Ayad Mukherjee, Brahmastra is all set to hit silver screens on September 9. Actor Siddhan Chaturvedi has finally leaked the reason behind his phone booth co-actor and friend Ishan Khattar being single and it is hilarious. On the 10th episode of the Tongue in Cheek chat show, Siddhant will be accompanied with his co-stars Katrina Kaif and Ishan Khattar. Host Karan Johar finally puts this curiosity to rest on his show by evoking a full and final response from Ishan on his current relationship status. It does not matter who broke up with whom, but I am currently single, finally declared doctor, but not without his close friend Siddhan Chaturvedi, revealing a possible reason for Ishan's singlehood. Siddhan added, Mere saath ghumte ghumte ye bhi single ho gaya. Phone Booth is a horror comedy film directed by Gurmeet Singh and produced by Farhan Akhtar and Ritesh Siddhwani under the banner of Excel Entertainment. The film revolves around a shop where every kind of problems involving ghosts are solved. Coffee with Current Season 7 airs on Disney Plus Hotstar. Bollywood actress Atiya Shetty and Indian cricketer KL Rahul are all set to take the plunge in a few months. The couple will be exchanging vows in the presence of their loved ones. What's more, the venue for the festivities is not some five-star hotel, but Sunil Shetty's bungalow Jahan in Khandala near Mumbai. The bungalow built by Sunil and Mana Shetty 17 years ago is very close to the heart of the actor and his wife. Spread over a sizable area, the bungalow sits in the lap of the nature and stands out for its mix of earthy colours. KL Rahul, who is Team India's opener now in Dubai for Asia Cup, publicly admitted being in relationship last year when the cricketer wished Atiya on her birthday with a social media post. Rahul also attended the premiere of Atiya's brother Ahan Shetty debut film Tada. The two have been in a relationship for almost three years and are often spotted at movie screening and parties. The two had recently moved into luxury sea-facing apartment in Bandra area of Mumbai. Friends of the Shetty family and Bollywood biggies have been reportedly asked to keep their schedules free from the end of December 2022 to the first week of January 2023. Bell icon. Never miss an update.